Psalms, chapter 10. Why standest thou far off, O Lord, and hidest thee in due time, even in affliction? The wicked with pride doth persecute the poor. Let them be taken in the crafts that they have imagined. For the wicked hath made boast of his own heart's desire, and the covetous blesses himself, he contendeth the Lord. The wicked is so proud that he seeketh not for God. He thinketh always there is no God. His ways always prosper. Thy judgments are high above his sight. Therefore defieth he all his enemies. He saith in his heart, I shall never be moved, nor be in danger. His mouth is full of cursing and deceit and fraud. Under his tongue is mischief and iniquity. He lieth in wait in the villages, in the secret places doth he murder the innocent. His eyes are bent against the poor. He lieth in wait secretly, even as a lion in his den. He lieth in wait to spoil the poor. He doth spoil the poor when he draweth him into his net. He crouches and boweth. Therefore heaps of the poor do fall by his might. He has said in his heart, God hath forgotten. He hideth away his face, and will never see. Arise, O Lord God, lift up thy hand, forget not the poor. Wherefore doeth the wicked condemn God? He saith in his heart, Thou wilt not regard. Yet thou hast seen it, for thou beholdest mischief and wrong, that thou mayest take it into thy hands. The poor commended himself unto thee, for thou art the helper of the fatherless. Verse 15. Break thou the arm of the wicked and malicious. Search his wickedness, and thou shalt find none. The Lord is king for ever and ever. The heathen are destroyed forth of his land. Lord, thou hast heard the desire of the poor. Thou preparest their heart. Thou beadrest thine ear to them, to judge the fatherless and poor. That earthly man cause to fear no more. End of chapter 10.